Oticon's new mall line of hearing aid built on their already highly successful open and open S devices aimed at providing the very best in sound quality and background noise separation without compromising on spatial and environmental cues. Traditionally, hearing aids are really focused on separating speech from background noise by making a really directional hearing aid meaning that sounds and speech coming from in front of you is really nice and crisp and clear, while sounds around you are muffled down. One of the downfalls of a system like this is you lose those spatial and environmental cues around you, and if somebody's even speaking on your left or right or not directly in front of you, you lose some of that speech clarity. So now that you have a bit more context about what we're talking about today, I'd like to welcome you to the Ear and Hearing channel. On today's episode of the show, we'll be looking at the Oticon More line of devices, the More 1, 2, and 3, looking at their features and benefits, and seeing whether these would be a good option for your next hearing aid. So as I said before, the Oticon More line of devices come in three technology levels, the More 1, More 2, and More 3. The More 1 is the premium level technology with the most features and functions, they have the most channels and the best noise management system. And the More 2 and More 3 are the advanced level of hearing aids with a few less features and functions. If you are looking at getting something from the More line of devices, depending on your lifestyle, listening needs, budget and many other considerations, you and your audiologist may choose any one of these three devices. As a team here at Ear and Hearing Australia, having fit many open and open as devices and now quite a few more line of devices, we really found that customers are really happy with the sound quality they've gotten from Oticon. Whether it's a retiree who wants to hear clearly at their Probus club, at bowls games and things like that, all the way to working professionals who have highly demanding lifestyles with meetings, restaurants, and functions, we found that these hearing aids, the more one, more two, and more three, have really given us a great outcome. So moving on from the audiological side of things, I want to move on to the technology features inside the device. In terms of connectivity, the more line of devices are compatible with both iPhone and Android. This means that for most newer iPhones 6S and above, you're both able to stream phone calls, movies, music, and much, much more directly to the hearing aids, and you're also able to control it by your app. On the Android side of things, it's a bit more complicated. Most Android phones from the past five years are compatible with their app, meaning you're able to control the programs and volume control and see battery status and things like that. However, only the very newest in Samsung and Google are able to stream directly to the devices. If you are looking at streaming from an older Android phone or maybe a computer or things like that, you may want to look at the Connect Clip, which is an additional accessory which you're able to clip onto your jacket, which acts as an intermediary between the phone and the hearing aids. But if you're looking for direct streaming capabilities to an Android phone, or to your computer or laptop, you may want to look at the Phonak, Paradise, or Marvel line of devices. Going back to Oticon's app, the Oticon On app i found has been the most reliable and stable app on the market. From time to time, Bluetooth being Bluetooth will still disconnect, but I've really found that it's been really intuitive and really stable, no matter whether you're on Android or iPhone. In terms of comfort and design, I found that they've been really quite comfortable. The hearing aid body isn't the thinnest on the market, but I really found that it isn't too thick and really doesn't interfere even with slightly thicker glasses. The hearing aids come with two separate buttons, which can be either configured as a volume rocker or a program switch or both. Depending on how your audiologist has configured it, you may have one, two, or both of those functions. I've found Oticon's domes to be quite standard. They're very comfortable. They have different sizes, different types, depending on the size of your ear canal and your type of hearing loss. But what I've really been impressed with is Oticon's molds. I found that the molds are extremely comfortable. They don't even feel like they're in the ear most of the time. And for those of you who have more severe losses, their retention is really quite good. 
one real consideration to keep in mind when you are purchasing the more devices is that they only come in a rechargeable version. If you are looking at sticking with Oticon, but you really need a battery operated version, going back a generation to the Open S devices may be a good option. I'd only possibly recommend this for people who go camping a lot or are away from a power source. But even for a rechargeable version, you can get a battery bank to charge it up on a daily basis. And I guess that's one of my gripes with the Oticon charger. It is quite big and bulky, and I really like that they have really strong magnets so the hearing aids sit in there very easily and don't come out. For elderly people who have dexterity issues, I found that this is one of the best chargers as it's nice and easy to put in. It doesn't come out, it charges quite reliably. But for those of you who have more active lifestyle, who are traveling frequently, this may not be the best option. I wish Oticon would put a battery pack or something in this charger so that people are able to take it away. If the power gets disconnected, they would still have power to the hearing aids. But as a safeguard, you may want to get a power bank just in case. In terms of battery life, the Oticon More hearing aids are set to last around 16 to 20 hours on a 3 to 4 hour charge. So for a lot of our clients, we recommend having the charger on the nightstand. So at night, you put the hearing aids into the charger, you take them out in the morning, they're fully charged, and they'll last you the whole day. Just a quick note before I wrap up, the Oticon More devices are available in a full range of colors all the way from diamond black to here pink so no matter your style or hair color i bet there's something which would suit you in summary if you're looking for a great pair of hearing aids with great clarity comfort and great performance in background noise and more complex situations i think the more line of devices are a fantastic option but overall, from all the clients I've seen and fitted with the more line of devices, I've been really happy with the outcomes and with the right fitting and care and with the right audiologist, I think these would be a fantastic option.